Good afternoon from Delhi Airport, India. Today I'm going to fly Nepal Airlines from here, Delhi, to Kathmandu. I've always been looking forward to flying with Nepal Airlines because Sam Chui and uh, Jash Cahill has flown on this route before. Air India also flies to Kathmandu, but they only use the A320 aircraft and uh, Nepal Airlines uses A330, so I was really keen to try it out. However, I just got my boarding pass and the check-in experience was one of the worst I've ever had in my life. I've flown 60 times, almost 60 times last year, and I believe I've flown at least 500 times in my life, and that was the worst experience in my life. So first of all, so it's time to go through immigration. Um, I spent seven days in India. Uh, it's a bit mixed feeling. I've met quite a few nice people, but I also got food poisoning in this country. So yeah, it's kind of a mixed feeling. Uh, I don't know if I'm gonna come back again. But for now, goodbye India. So here it is, Nepal Airlines brand new A330-200 aircraft delivered to Nepal Airlines in June 2018 Arrived um, one hour behind schedule by the way Seat, which features a seat back screen and um, the seat itself is quite narrow actually I guess it has a pitch of 76 centimeter because it's quite narrow and the seat width is probably 17 it's well, more like Qantas is um, Boeing 787 Dreamliner seat it's quite narrow but I guess for a two hour flight like this one it's more than enough but one thing I love is the Himalayas um, background on the screen and at the back of the plane as well. That's what I really love. It's really good. Enjoy your flight.
hot meal service on a 70 minute flight so yeah pretty well done I'm pretty impressed with it So yeah, shortly after dinner service, we began our approach into Kathmandu, Nepal. It was a short flight. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have landed at Juwan International Airport in Kathmandu. We'd like to thank you for flying Nepal Airlines. Namaste and hope to see you again. So, um, welcome to Kathmandu, Nepal. It took me so long to go here. Um, well, how's Nepal Airlines? Well, it was overall a really great experience. First of all, the plane. The plane is brand new. Almost new. Yeah. The plane is brand new. Uh, however, the seat is a bit narrow, but for a short flight, for a two hour flight uh, like this, uh, I have no problem with it. Um, the highlight of this flight uh, is uh, in flight entertainment. It has 14 movies and um, it's definitely enough to kill the time for me and uh, the touch screen is really responsive and um, yeah just really enjoyable to use it in terms of the flight attendants um, they were really efficient uh, for a short flight like this they were able to serve a full meal a full dinner during this flight so that was amazing and um, the food as well it was really delicious the chicken with rice was so good i really enjoyed it so overall out of five stars i'd give nepal airline a three and a half star i'm now at everest view hotel at an elevation of 3850 meters in the background is mount everest and mount lord say <laughs> amazing view isn't it thank you so much for watching my video if you guys like it please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. After Nepal, I'll be heading to China to spend Chinese New Year over there. And after that, I go, I'll be going to Russia and Norway. So there will be a lot of interesting content coming up. Thank you again for watching my video and I'll see you guys again soon. Hacking experience was one of the worst I've ever had in my life. I've flown 60 times, almost 60 times last year and I believe I've flown at least 500 times in my life and that was the worst experience in my life. So first of all, I booked my ticket on Nepal Airlines official website on the 6th of November and then I changed my plan and I made a, and I changed my date for my booking so I made a rebooking on the 29th of November. So it was all perfectly fine. I paid the new fee and I got my new booking confirmation and I even printed it out which is right here. It, it's right here. And then I arrived at the airport three hours before the flight because I wanted to have a good seat. You know I always like a window seat and I want a perfect window seat. When I checked out the checking agent found out like there's a problem in the system that they couldn't find my booking. There's an error in my booking. I think this is Nepal Airlines internal problem and then they just made me stand on the side for 40 bloody minutes no apologies whatsoever and I and uh, I couldn't pre-book my seat on our airline website they don't have this feature then um, I asked for a specific seat which is 32A that's what the seat I liked at the time of checking that seat was available but once they solved the problem which is 40 minutes later that seat is gone now I was assigned to a new seat 35A which is like the fourth last row on the airplane the seat that I didn't like actually so this is my horrible horrible checking experience with Nepal Airlines absolutely disgusting first impression I hope they can do better on the plane